Good evening. Well, we did start to warm up today as expected. In fact, we made it to 78 degrees and started the morning cool with 45. So it turned out to be a very nice day here as temperatures went above average today. We were below average yesterday and now we're back into the warm air. So what's coming our way? Tomorrow is going to be gorgeous. Another beautiful day. A little more of a breeze tomorrow and a little warmer than today, but still lots of sunshine. Enjoy it because Saturday is the day of Right from the start, it's going to cool down and it's going to be very windy Saturday. We may even get a shower early in the morning, but that's about it. And then we have those cold nights this weekend. Yeah, you'll need those heaters turned on as we're looking at 30s and low 40s this weekend. Tonight, not that cold. Temperatures are dropping down into the 40s. We'll have just some patchy fog around and lower 50s at the coastline tonight with 53 at the Naval Air Station, 57 Port Aransas tonight. Corpus Christi down to 48 degrees. So cool, but seasonably so tonight. Nothing too surprising out there for your Thursday night. And then tomorrow, still a lot of sunshine. Gorgeous day. Wasn't today beautiful? Man, it was beautiful out there today. A lot of folks were talking about it, but uh, tomorrow is going to be about as nice. We make it to near 80 degrees and we'll see again just a little fog in the morning here and there and that's it. Lots of sun. The wind starting to pick up a bit. Temperatures 80 from Alice to Corpus Christi tomorrow. Upper 70s from Sinton to Beeville. Beautiful at the coastline too. Lower to mid 70s uh, for the coast tomorrow and plenty of sun. Okay, tomorrow is going to be a little bit more humid. We have the onshore flow returning. The winds coming from the southeast and south and the air uh, it moistens up a little bit but look at that drop very low humidity and that coupled with the wind for saturday is going to cause some issues this is the forecast relative humidity and when it gets down to these levels that air is extremely dry and this is for saturday afternoon so with the wind and with that low humidity we're looking at a fire weather watch for saturday meaning fires would spread very quickly in these conditions where is the watch it is for much of this uh, coastal bend including nueces and san patricio counties to live oak and southward and then as you go north it hasn't been issued yet no fire weather watch but still it's going to be windy and it's still pretty dry. So just not a good day Saturday to do any outdoor burning. Now let's take a look at that front. Here's future tracker. This is jumping ahead to tomorrow morning. It's going to be a beautiful start to your Friday tomorrow, but you'll notice those winds come around to the south. They pick up a little bit tomorrow. Tomorrow night, that's what you're looking at here. See the clouds and then we get a few showers right along that front. It'll be moving through Beeville and George West by three in the morning and then getting closer to Corpus Christi by five in the morning in and Rockport in Kingsville and notice not much rain with it. If you hear some rain on your roof, it won't last long. It moves out very quickly, but that wind that's going to be the main feature with this front and the cooler air this weekend. Sustained wind forecast. You can see are pretty light through tomorrow, picking up just a little at the coast. But when we get to Saturday morning, we're talking 20 to 30 mile an hour winds. We have we'll have gale warnings off the coastline because of that. Uh, and it's just going to be a windy, cool day Saturday and not to mention and this is the peak wind gust, 40 to 45 mile an hour wind gusts at the coast, up to 36 inland. So certainly that's going to be the main feature with this front. So let's take a look at it on the seven day forecast. Then you can see uh, the weekend's going to be cool. Tomorrow's very nice, but then we get a stray shower early Saturday at wind all day long and still pretty breezy and cool Sunday. Look at these nights. I think Corpus Christi may touch near freezing. It's going to be a little tricky because of the wind Saturday night stirring up the air, but the air is going to be cold wind chills. When you combine the wind with the temperature, we're talking 20s is what it's going to feel like. So we need the coats if you're going to be outdoors Saturday night or even Sunday night before we slowly warm up again next week. There's our next cold front Wednesday night, Paul. <sighs> I know you didn't like that very much, but yeah, it is going to be awfully chilly. Good I'm weekend to stay you, indoors. This is not, I'm not a medical professional, but this is not good for the body to go from 80 to 33 back to 80. At least it's not ice and snow, right? Yes. Cup half full. Sharon right. Ray. Always a ray of sunlight there. <laughs>